Well, this summer's relentless heat is one for the record books. That is the message from NOAA and NASA earlier today. Meteorologist Candace Campos listened in to their briefing about this. Candace, what did they have to say? Well, Lisa Ginger, July 2023 was not only the warmest July on record globally, this past month now holds the record for the hottest month ever recorded on record. In today's presser hosted by NASA, scientists explained how measurements taken from space are having a big impact back down on Earth. At NASA, we're observing the Earth so we can understand both what's happening today, but also how that's changed over time. So we can observe the impacts of climate change, like sea level rise, wildfire, extreme heat. We can also observe the drivers of climate change, like greenhouse gases, carbon dioxide and methane um, that are increasing in the atmosphere and trapping heat. And the heat isn't only being felt on land. Currently, over 40% of the ocean is experiencing, experiencing a marine heat wave. Earlier this month, buoy data recorded ocean temperatures near 100 degrees near the Florida Keys, impacting our coral reefs. Unfortunately, coral reefs cannot grow legs and move away. So they have to stay put and experience the brunt of global warming. They are super important for the marine ecosystem. About 25% of marine species have something to do with corals. They contribute with medicine. They contribute with livelihood to millions of people. They protect the coastline from tidal surges and storms. And scientists are looking towards the rest of the year, forecasting for the current marine heat wave to continue into the fall or even longer. And along with a 99% chance that 2023's global temperature will rank among the five warmest years on record. Lisa. Candace, thank you.